Hey, what's up YouTube? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to get a custom watermark for every single one of your YouTube videos. Now, if you've ever seen any YouTube videos, anytime you watch them, they have that little image on the bottom right corner where it can either be a profile picture or a nice little subscribe button, just like this one right here. And when you hover over it, it'll give you a quick and easy subscribe link for your channel itself. Now I'm gonna show you how to do that. Now, if you're looking for any other YouTube creator tips and tricks to raise your channel's branding, you can check out the link in the description for the entire video series playlist on YouTube creator tips and tricks. So let's go ahead and get into this one. So once you've logged into your YouTube account, you want to click on your profile picture in the top right corner. And then you want to click on your YouTube Studios link. It'll take you to your studio dashboard. Now once you've got your studio dashboard open, on the left hand side, you want to click on the settings link. It'll bring you to the settings pop up. Then you want to select the channel tab, and then you want to go over to the branding tab. Once you're on the branding tab, this is actually where you're going to upload your watermark image for every single one of your videos. And YouTube gives you a couple of very straightforward instructions and recommendations on the image itself. So they want it to be a PNG or a GIF image. It should be a perfectly square image that's about 150 by 150 pixels and should be one megabyte or less. And they also recommend using an image with one or two different colors as a transparent background. Now, if you're not exactly sure what image that you want to use, maybe you don't want to use your channel profile picture itself, then there'll be a link in the description for a YouTube image pack. It'll have a couple of different options that you are more than welcome to use. Now you want to click on the choose image link and you want to browse to where you have your image saved on your computer. Now I'm going to be using this one right here. It has a very simple white YouTube logo with a subscribe text. And this is a PNG image that's 200 by 200 pixels. This image will be included in the YouTube creator pack that will be linked down in the description. Now YouTube gives you a couple of different options for when your watermark will actually be displayed to your viewers. You can either show it at the end of the video, the entire video, or you can have it start at a custom time. Now if you're showing it at the end of the video, then YouTube will automatically show it the last 15 seconds of the video, depending on how long the video is, but generally speaking, the last 15 seconds, or you can show it on the entire video, which is what I recommend and what most people end up using, or if you want to choose to start your watermark being displayed to your viewers at a very specific time in every single one of your videos, so maybe you want to have it start being shown after the first five seconds of the video, you can do that as well. So I'm going to choose the entire video option and then just hit the save button. And then after a couple of seconds, you should get a notification saying your settings have been saved. And that's it. Anytime any of your viewers open up one of your videos, they'll see that nice, sweet watermark image on every single one of your videos that anytime they hover over top of it, it'll give them a nice, quick and easy subscribe button for your channel. If you found this video helpful, go ahead and hit that like button. And if you're looking for more YouTube creator tips and tricks for raising your channel's branding, there'll be a link in the description for the entire video series playlist for the YouTube creator tips. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so that way you can be notified when new videos come out. And I'll see you in the next one.